What's going on guys? Today in this video, we are making Southwest Beef Kamatapi courtesy of HelloFresh. Guys, if you don't know what HelloFresh is, it's a meal delivery service that delivers all the ingredients straight to your door. It's an easy to follow recipe for a really affordable price. If you want to give HelloFresh a try, down in the description is a link uh, that will give you a great deal and also help support the channel. Also down in the description, if you just want to give the recipe a try, it's all the ingredients you need and the simple follow instructions as well. As always guys, if you like the video, don't forget to smash that like button, hit that sub button and turn on the notifications. That way you get notified when we put out more content just like this. And with that said guys, let's get into the video. Okay guys, before we start getting cooking, we're gonna go over all the ingredients we need to make this delicious dish. What's included in the HelloFresh delivery is one pepper, green onion, six ounces of cavatari pasta, 10 ounces of ground beef, one tablespoon of Southwest spice blend, which includes garlic, chili powder, and cumin. 14 ounces of diced tomatoes, two containers of concentrated beef stock, two tablespoons of sour cream, four tablespoons of smoky red pepper creme, and a half a cup of Mexican cheese blend, one teaspoon of hot sauce, and that's everything included with the HelloFresh delivery. The other items that you'll need outside of the delivery is um, ground pepper, salt, butter, and some cooking oil. And that's everything you need to make this delicious dish. Okay, so now that we have all the ingredients, let's get cooking. First, take a large pot and fill it with salt water and bring it to a boil. Then, half and de-seed and thinly slice the pepper into strips. Trim and then thinly slice the scallion, separating the whites from the grains. Okay, so now that everything's all chopped up, it's time to cook the pasta. Once the water is boiling, add the cavatappi pasta into the pot. Stir occasionally until al dente. This should take about nine to 11 minutes. Reserve one cup of pasta water. Then drain the pasta. Meanwhile, heat a large drizzle of oil in a medium pan over medium high heat. Add the pepper and season with salt and pepper into the pan. 
Cook and stir occasionally until slightly softened. This should take about four to five minutes. Okay, so now that the peppers are softened, we're gonna cook the beef. Add a drizzle more oil and add the beef and the white part of the scallion into the pan. Season with the southwest spice, salt, and pepper. As we're cooking, we're gonna break up the meat into small pieces. We're gonna keep cooking until the beef is browned and cooked through. This should take about four to six minutes. Once the beef is cooked, add half of the diced tomatoes. While cooking, stir occasionally. This should take about 30 seconds more. Add half a cup of the reserved pasta water. and mix in the concentrated beef stock. Season with half a tablespoon of salt and a pinch of pepper. Bring to a simmer and cook, stirring until thickened. This should take about two to three minutes. Once thickened, reduce to a low heat and stir in the pasta. Add in the sour cream. The smoky red pepper creme. And half of the Mexican cheese. Also add in one tablespoon of butter and hot sauce to taste. Season with salt and pepper. Okay, now that everything's warmed up, we're ready to plate. Okay guys, this is a relatively simple plating. Uh, we're just gonna take the pasta, put it in the bowl, put a little cheese on top, and a little green onion on top as well. Very simple to do. Uh, yeah, let's go for, it. go for it. You can use a bowl or plate to plate it up. I prefer to eat pasta out of a bowl, so we're gonna use a bowl for me. But you pretty much do the same for a bowl. Let's take nice, good help. Healthy servings of pasta. This should serve two people. There we go guys, so this is Southwest Beef Cavatami. Looks delicious. And there you guys go, that's how you make the Southwest Beef Cavatami, courtesy of HelloFresh. Guys, if you're interested in trying out HelloFresh, down in the description there's a link for HelloFresh. It'll give you a great deal and also help support the channel. If you just want to try this dish, down in the description is all the ingredients and the recipe to follow to make this delicious dish. Overall guys, I'd rate this an 8 out of 10. I thought it was really good, had a good flavor to it. Uh, definitely a dish I'd try again and definitely worth trying. Guys, if you want to share what you thought of this, comment it down below. As always guys, if you like the video, don't forget to smash that like button and hit that sub button and turn on notifications. That way you get notified when we do more content just like this. And if you did like this video, probably like this video right here as well. And with that said guys, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.